Hey everybody, it's James. How you doing today? Welcome back to the channel. I am excited for today's movie as it's been requested about 300 times and I'm like, I gotta get to it. I really do. And so we're having a big, uh, I don't know, action weekend, I guess is the way to put it. Uh, and so I am doing Top Gun 2 Maverick. What do I know? I know quite a lot, actually. Usually I don't know anything about these movies. I know this is a Tom's Cruise vehicle. Haha, -ha, pun intended. And, <laughs> and it has to do with fighter jets and like Top Gun School, which it's not called Top Gun anymore, I don't think. I think it's called something else. And I'm hoping we're going to get some, like, reoccurring characters. I'm, you know, positive, like, Tom Cruise's character's in it. But maybe some of the other characters from the past movie are going to be in it. I'm hoping. Um, if you don't know the backstory on me is I am an ex-farmer who lived in the middle of nowhere and only had three channels on my TV. So we just didn't really bother unless we were watching, like, the news or, like, Wheel of Fortune or something like that. And so I uh, read books, and I've been reading books for 30 years. I am a massive bookworm, and I just haven't been paying attention to movies for a long time. My uh, oldest children convinced me it's time to dive into pop culture and start watching all the awesome U.S. movies I've missed over the last 30 years. So that's what this channel is all about. I hope you subscribe and go on this journey with me. I've been doing this for a couple of years now. And if you go back in my catalog and watch some of my, like, early stuff, I don't know who anybody is. <laughs> I'm just now learning, like, who some actors are and things like that. I'm starting to really get into the movies and starting to enjoy them. Um, but, yeah, I'm super excited about watching Top Gun Maverick. Uh, so let's uh, get into it. Ooh, are we going to get some, like, the uh, same music as the first one? I remember this from the very first one like wasn't the first one like you were like on the tarmac of an aircraft carrier and this was playing in the background i've watched a lot of movies since since that one came out but this this music sounds really familiar from the first one tom cruise today navy calls fighter fighter weapons school okay but this happened last time right the same words top gun yes maverick i like the logo I'm really interested to see if they're gonna like invite people from the last one, like forward. Ooh, what is this little thing? That was kind of cool. Oh, Ed Harris. I know Ed Harris. Val Kilmer. He's from the first one, right? Yeah, this is from the first one. Music by Lady Gaga? I don't think she wrote this one. Danger Zone's been around for a long time. That little observation booth is super cool. Yeah, that's so cool how they do that. If you ever get a chance, there's several aircraft carriers throughout the United States now that you can go visit and like stand on. And it really helps you appreciate the, just the size and these things. They're ginormous. They're humongous. And they're all that, like, V-shape now. They used to just be a straight, and now they're all kind of V-shaped. That way you can have two different aircraft going at the same time. Mojave Desert. This looks like Tom to me. He's got a pretty... Look at that see-through plane. Is... Oh, he just doesn't have the outside on it. That'd be cool if that was all fiberglass and you could see everything. Oh, it's Goose. I was so sad when Goose died. I bought... I bawled when Goose died. His wife was so cute. I don't think I've seen his wife in anything else except for Top Gun. Oh, the leather jacket. In the Mojave Desert. Mach 9, is that what that said? How is sucky. I'm excited for this. A little adrenaline going, some fighter jets and stuff. Oh, what is this fancy thing? Hey, what is it? We've been ordered to stand down. Oh. The contract threshold is Mach 10. Today's test point is Mach 9. That's not good enough. Says who? Admiral Kane. The drone ranger. He wants our budget for his unmanned program. The drone ranger? That's funny. Well, he isn't here yet. Let's give him Mach 10. 
Maverick doing what he does, not really following orders. Oh my, we have to do a test before we even get into it. I don't like that look, man. Are we doing some experimental stuff or what? Have we gone Mach 10? Ready, lift, engine, start. Ooh, fancy, ready? fancy. Towers is Dark Star, we're ready for takeoff. Dark Star. Rear Admiral Chester Kane. Oh, hi, Ed. Kane just pulled up to the gate. It's not too late to stop, buddy. He ain't gonna stop. I know what happens to everyone else if I don't. Oh, supporting his team. Go for takeoff. Dark Star, control. Yeah, we're doing some experimental stuff. One last ride. You don't have that kind of a support staff unless you're doing some experimental stuff. <laughs> the roof just came off. Increased to Mach 3.5. That was funny. Just in time, sir. I'm early. So are you. Care to explain? Transitioning to scramjet. Scramjet. Oh, got a boost out of that. Holy uh, Matt, crap. Admiral Kane is asking. Ordering. Ordering that we bring her down. Uh, uh, Passing uh, uh. <laughs> Yeah, communications error. What altitude are we at? Mach 7. Mach 7. Eight. At these speeds, like at these speeds, you're you're traveling across the entire like North American <laughs> part of the hemisphere very quickly. It would not take you long to go from uh, L.A. to New York and just Mach nine. Twenty minutes. Yeah, starting to get some friction from the air. Approaching high hypersonic. Holy crap, look at that. Seven. Oh my goodness. Surface temp rising. Pucker factor level 10. Just a little. Nine, nine. Come on. <laughs> okay, back off to like Mach 3. Oh, he didn't like that. No. Uh, Mav? Maverick. Oh, don't do it. Oh, no. <laughs> this is the problem with Maverick. 10-1. You got some balls, stick jockey. I'll give you that. Oh, bad things, bad things, bad things, bad things. Maverick. Did he just destroy that entire plane? Yeah, where is he at? I don't think that killed him. Yeah, no. <laughs> he ejected. Oh, you look better, buddy. <laughs> Cute kid. Where, I bet he's like, where am I? Where am I? Yeah. Uh, Earth? <laughs> They're not used to seeing something like that, probably. 30 plus years of service. Citations. Yeah. Distinguished. And despite your best efforts, you refuse to die. <laughs> At least a two-star admiral by now. Yet here you are. Vote for Tom! <laughs> I'm where I belong. The Navy doesn't see it that way. Not anymore. Uh, I want him on the road to North Island within the hour. North Island? What's that? You've been called back to Top Gun. Go at it, buddy. San Diego, California. Been there. Went to Petco Park. One of the cool things about San Diego is it's a very, very, very dog-friendly school. I mean, city, probably the most dog-friendly city I've ever been to. You can bring your dogs into restaurants and just... Everybody just sits out outside with their dogs and hangs out. and It's really chill. Yeah. There's Maverick and Iceman. Tom Iceman Kazansky, Commander, U.S. Pacific Fleet. He's done well for himself. The reputation precedes you. Thank you, sir. Wasn't a compliment. <laughs> Warlock, sir. Did he call him Warlock? Wasn't he in the first one? The target is an unsanctioned uranium enrichment plant. The Pentagon oh. has tasked us with assembling a strike team and taking it out. The plant sits in an underground bunker at the end of this valley. GPS jammed and defended by an extensive surface-to-air missile array. Wow. What's your read, Captain? Two precision bombs? That is one hell of a steep climb out of there. When you survive that, it's a dogfight all the way home. Wow. Tall order. No, someone's not coming back from this. Well, it's been a while since I've flown an F-18, and I'm not sure who I trust to fly the other three. We don't want you to fly it. Uh, we want you to teach it. Of course. Okay, this is Top Gun School. Okay. We want you to narrow that pool down to six. Who's that? 
Is there a problem, Captain? Why'd they zoom in on him? I understand he used to fly with his old man. <gasps> Goose. Goose and Rooster. Goose's death was an accident. It's his kid. You were a Top Gun instructor before. That was almost 30 years ago. I lasted two months. Oh no, he was only there for two months? You are not my first choice. You were here at the request of Admiral Kazansky. So Iceman put him up for it. You fly for Top Gun, or you don't fly for the Navy ever again. Boy, choices, choices. What to do? <laughs> Dang! Well, who was that? Ice! You could have warned me. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Pete. Penny? Well, obviously, we know each other. Who'd you piss off this time? Another admiral. Hmm. <laughs> In the last one, didn't he have, like, some affair with an admiral's daughter? Bought this place about three years ago. Oh, wow. She owns it. I think this is it. You said it after they busted you for taking me on a joyride in that F-18. Ooh. And the next thing, you get yourself in trouble. Iceman makes a call. Oh, how long has Iceman been bailing him out? Penny. You're about to ask me what time I get off. Don't give me that look. She's flirting. It always ends the same with us, P. Let's not start this time. I don't know. She looks like fun. Somebody I wanted to start things with. <laughs> what was that? What am I missing? Yeah. Just everybody gets around. Fellas, this here's Bagman. Hangman. Bagman? Who are your friends? Payback. Fanboy. Hey, Coyote. Hey. Who's he? That's Floyd. <laughs> Can't you read his name tag? What do they call you? Bob. Your call sign. Bob. His call sign is Bob? That's not a great call sign. I'll have four more on the old timer. This is gonna cost him a small fortune. Okay, who's got the old Bronco? Oh, this is Rooster. He's got an old, lovely old Bronco. The way they're supposed to look. Whoa! Oh, Jesus. It's good to see you. It's good to see you too. Much appreciated, Pops. I'm assuming all these people coming in are his, his recruits that he has to teach. We're getting call names and we're getting all this other stuff. Did he make that? You might know what this uh, special detachment is all about. What I want to know, who's going to be team leader? The problem with bar tables is all the sticks are complete and utter crap. The tips are completely worn out. Yeah, you can scuff the crap out of them and they're just so compressed they're useless. Well, that's just you and Rooster waiting for just the right moment that never comes. Do these two have a beef with each other? This guy looks familiar to me. The guy that's playing Rooster? More patches. What the hell kind of mission is this? That's not the question we should be asking. Who the hell are they gonna get to teach us? I know. You do too, don't you? It's been declined. Uh-oh. <gasps> is he gonna do the same thing his dad did? How about? That won't cover it. How much was it? Rules are rules, Pete. Now what? <laughs> what are they doing with him? Oh. <laughs> They just tossed him out. Not a good start there, Maverick. Yeah, he's playing the same dot, the same song his dad was doing. But you came along and all the fire. Fire. Yeah, there's Goose. And there's his kiddo. Man, I bawled after that moment. What is going on? Jeez, that's scary. Oh, was that Goose? Oh no. If he's just knocked out or something. Sir, let go of him. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> that's bullshit. Yeah. Very sad. Let's get some schooling done. Welcome to your special training detachment. The elite, the best of the best. They say that a lot. Half of you will make the cut. One of you will be named mission leader. The other half will remain in reserve. Okay. Your instructor is a Sounds top gun fair. graduate with real world experience, and he's considered to be one of the finest pilots this program has ever produced. Mm-hmm. The guy you threw out of the bar last night. Good morning. Oh, I don't think Rooster's you happy about it. 18 natops. I'm assuming you know the book. Damn right. Yeah. Damn straight. So does your enemy. Oh. But what the enemy doesn't know is your limits. I intend to find them. Yeah, I love this. Show me what you're made of. Rooster, Lieutenant Bradshaw. Let's not do it like this. You gonna wash me out? That'll be up to you, not me. Am I dismissed? What's the beef here? Like, they obviously have a big time beef with each other. 
Maverick is suiting up though, so he's going up with him. Welcome good. to basic fighter maneuvers. Good soundtrack so far. We just shot down 200 push ups. 200 push ups? You got yourself a deal, gentlemen. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Wake up, boys. Let's try not to get fired on the first day. Well, that's a, that's a good plan. Break, break. Rooster just saved your life, fellas. Not this time, old man. Oh. How good is Maverick? Oh, that's a kill. Oh. <laughs> 200 push ups. Oh, goodness, taking selfies with him. Oh, nice. That's a kill. Oh. Smoke. Oh. Everybody's going down. <laughs> Buddy, Bob stands for something. Don't take the bait, Bob. Baby on board. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, my gosh. My son. Where's he going? That's why we call him Hangman. Hang you out to dry. Oh, really? Get off me, Hangman. This is how you bury a fossil. You're out, Phoenix. Son of a bitch. Let's go, man. Oh, they're doing them one by one? <laughs> oh, he's putting them in the sun so he can't see. Where is he? That's a kill. Oh! <laughs> Behind you! That's where he was! I got you, Omaha. Put them all in their place, one by one. Yeah! Rooster, so what's the story with you and Maverick? It's none of your business. Now, where the hell is he? Been here the whole time. Oh, he's underneath them! You see me now? Fight's on! Duh! What are they doing? All right, you put us here. How are you gonna get yourself out? I can go as low as you, sir. Wow, these two have a problem. Our deck is 5,000 feet, fellas. You are running out of room. This is a really bad idea. Pull up. Jeez. Ah, 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 you got him. Drop down and take the shot. It's too low. You had your chance. Jump. There he goes, right over the top of you. That's a kill. Damn it. Go see Hondo about your push-ups. Yeah, more push-ups for Rooster. 400 push-ups for Rooster. Oh, a little bit of strain in there. You get kicked out, you leave us flying with Hangman. Oh, so she wants him over Hangman. Maverick, he pulled my application in the Naval Academy. Really? Sent me back four years. Why? Why would he do that? Does this have something to do with his dad? 5,000 feet above ground level. 5,000 feet is not just a rule, it is a law. The hard deck will be much lower for the mission, sir. And it will not change without my approval. I never want to see that shit again. I still have something to learn. You are talking about the best fighter pilots on the planet. And they've been told that their entire career. Mm. You have less than three weeks to teach them how to fight as a team and how to strike the target. Boy, he does not like Maverick. And how to come home, sir. Of course, get home. Every mission has its risks. Oh. These pilots accept that. He's less concerned about the get home part. From this day forward, you will brief us on your instructional plans, and nothing will change without my express approval. Including the hard deck, sir? Especially the hard deck. Sir. What is this? It's a request to lower the hard decks. Ah! I just saw that coming. The minute he put it down, I'm like, I bet he's requesting. Take a look at this. The man, the legend. Next to him. You look familiar to you? Yeah, it's a dad. Bradshaw. Boy, the competition and just. Instead of supporting each other. I just came by to pay off a debt. Mom! Sure. Don't worry about it. I insist. I wonder how much it was. Consider your tab closed. Looks like about a thousand bucks, seven hundred bucks, somewhere in there. Just use the engine. I can help. Whoa! What, look at the keel on that sucker, wow. Depower the sails! What does that mean? You're supposed to be in the Navy! I don't sail boats, Penny. I land on... <laughs> Pull on that green line up there. That's funny because um, in um, a few good men, he was complaining about going on a a, a boat to get across like to the island. It was uh, Demi Moore, right? She's like, for Christ, you're in the Navy. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't like boats, so it doesn't matter what the franchise is. If he's in the Navy, he doesn't like boats. Just not that crazy about boats. That's all. Jesus Christ, Kathy, you're in the Navy. That's a beautiful sailboat. Now you're in the Navy. That's pretty. Thanks for helping out today. Don't give me that look. What look? Yeah, what look? Good night, Pete. Oh, she likes him. Time on target. You'll fly along this narrow canyon to your target. 
Oh my gosh. Just air missiles defend the area, but they were designed to protect the skies above. But look at because that the enemy canyon. Knows no one is insane enough to try and fly below them. Yeah. Your altitude will be 100 feet. A hundred feet? Your airspeed will be 660 knots. Minimum. Time to target, two and a half minutes. That's because fifth generation fighters wait at an airbase nearby. That's why you need to get in, hit your target, and be gone before these planes even- Wow, this is a tall order, man. Holy crap. You'll fly a route in your nav system that simulates the canyon. The tighter the turns, the more intensely the force of gravity. 5.7 Gs. Impairing your judgment and reaction time. Good luck. Wow. We are two seconds behind. Increase to 480 knots. Oh, shit. Oh, jeez. Oh. Why are they dead? We broke the 300-foot ceiling. I slowed down and I didn't give her a warning. Was there a reason you didn't communicate with your team? I was focusing on... One that their family will accept at the funeral. Oh, wow. Ouch. Increase your speed. Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. What happened? Well, I flew as fast as I could. You put your team in danger and your wingman's dead. They couldn't keep up. He's cocky. Wow. We're 20 seconds behind and drop it. Just trust me. Maintain your speed. Why are you dead? Was he going too slow? He's the only one who made it to the target. A minute late. A minute late. Four minutes instead of three. We'd still have a chance. In an F-18. It's not the plane, sir. It's the pilot. Exactly. Mm-hmm. There's more than one way to fly this mission. What's the other way? Man flies like Maverick here, or a man does not come back. No offense. Yet somehow, you always manage. He sure does. Where's his partner? Where's Hangman's partner? That's no time to be thinking about the past. What's that supposed to mean? Maverick flew with his old okay. man. That's enough. Oh, why is he bringing this up now? He's such an ass. Oh, my God. He's not cut out for this mission. It's enough. You know I'm right. He's just doing it to yank his chain. You're all dismissed. That's why he was doing it. It's been good so far. I'm in, I'm in it like, oh, I need to see you. Maverick. It's a comeback. There's nothing else they can do. Oh, no. Some type of cancer or something that's come back. <coughs> that's Iceman, all right. That's my wingman. What can I do for you? He wants to talk about work. A rooster's still angry with me. Are we going to get the backstory on that? I hoped he'd forgive me. Yeah. The kid's not ready. He doesn't want what I have to give. Nice. <laughs> He's like, ah! Don't ask me to send him. It's time to let go. I mm. don't know how. Yeah. I'm not a teacher, Ice. I'm a fighter pilot. It's not what I am. It's who I am. Of course. It's all you've ever known. If I send him on this mission, he might never come home. Are we going to see his mom at all? And if I don't send him, he'll never forgive me. The history these two have builds a very deep relationship. The Navy needs Maverick. The kid needs Maverick. That's why I fought for you. Aww. Thank you, Ice, for everything. One last thing. Who's the better pilot? This is a nice moment. It's not really. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What are you going to do, Mav? Where is everybody? Just a reminder that I'm offering a seven day free trial to new Patreons. That is where you can find all my full reactions and this exclusive content. Oh, we're playing football. Oh, sand football. Why do we have two footballs? That makes no sense to me. Is there some new like dueling footballs thing? <laughs> Boy, Tom's still in pretty good shape for his age. What is this? It's dogfight football. Offense and defense at the same time. Oh. This detachment still has some training to complete, Captain. Why are we out here playing games? You said Te to create a team. Team building, yeah. Bob, <laughs> Bob. Those are fun days. Little Porsche. Oh, we left the door open, Mav. Boy, there's a lot of sequences that are basically just, you know, copies of the... Uh, Previous film, instead of volleyball, we're playing football. Little love scene in here. I'm gonna laugh if he makes like a little paper airplane for her. And you and Amelia, you seem a lot closer. You know, she always wanted more freedom than I thought she was ready for. Where'd she get that from? I wonder. <laughs> was mom a rebel? I also had to trust her. A billion percent. Not an easy choice. No. Is that what happened with Rooster? Oh, backstory. I pulled his papers from the Naval Academy 
dark years of his career. But why? His mother never wanted him to fly, not after what happened to Goose. She made me promise before she died, so. <gasps> Is Rooster know that? No way. He will always resent me for what I did. Yeah. So mom passed away and made him promise to look out for him. And she didn't want him to fly. I was trying to be the father he was. I wish I would have done it better. Don't we all? Is he ready now? Uh oh I have an example to set. I can't be bringing guys home on a first date. This is not our first date. Yeah, it's not your first date. What What about his shoes and stuff? This is the last time I go out your window. I'll never even leave you again. Oh. Oh, shut up. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> Just don't break her heart again. Oh, that's nice. The uranium enrichment plant that is your target will be operational earlier than expected. That's not good. One week. We have one week left to focus on phase two. It's a pop-up strike with a steep dive requiring nothing less than two consecutive miracles. So fly in a welded wing formation. Welded wing formation. As you know, the plant rests between two mountains. You'll invert directly into a steep dive. Oh, geez. Your target is an impact point less than three meters wide. Three meters. The first pair will breach Six the yards. reactor by dropping a laser-guided bomb on an exposed ventilation hatch. That's miracle number one. The second team will deliver the kill shot and destroy the target. Okay. That's miracle number two. If either team misses the target, mission is a failure. Yeah, you were nowhere near it. G, climb out to avoid hitting this mountain. You're pulling at least eight Gs. Nine. Wow. You'll be pulling so hard, you weigh close to 2,000 pounds. Oh, my God. Crushing and fighting with everything you have just to keep from blacking out. <laughs> Within seconds, you'll be fired upon by enemy Sam's. Is this even achievable? We'll come down to the pilot in the box. This does not sound good. We got to move. We got to move. Wait, who's that? You've been spotted. Oh, no. Blue team, what are you going to do? Your call. Continue. Be ready on that laser, Bob. Copy. Ooh, toys. Popping now. Go up, 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 up. Where's Maverick? Sorry, I can't get locked. Not even close. Oh, God. Oh, my gosh. She's losing it. That's Tone. Level out, Coyote. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Coyote, come in. Oh, goodness. I'm going after him. What are you going to do? Step out of it, Coyote. Come on. Oh, it's in his ears. Coyote, come on. Oh, jeez. Okay. He's okay. <laughs> That's enough for today. First strike. Oh. First strike. That's bad. That's bad. Shutting off fuel to left engine. Phoenix is on fire. Oh, my God. Oh my gosh. I don't want anybody to die in this one. Punch out, punch out. I can't control it. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Eject, eject, go, eject. go, jump out, jump out. Oh. Nobody hit the thing. Okay, they both got out. Okay. <laughs> I didn't want anybody hitting the canopy. They're gonna be okay. Good. I've never lost a wingman. Fly long enough, it'll happen. That was said to him. Easy for you to say. Ah, oh. Rooster. Go home. Why'd you pull my papers at the academy? Tell him the truth, Mav. You weren't ready. Trust your instincts. Don't think. You think up there, you're dead. Believe me. My dad believed in you. He had nothing to do with it. Maverick. Oh, no. Did Iceman die? He did. That's a wonderful photo. There would be a lot of people at that funeral. Oh my gosh, look at all of his awards. Holy crap. Someone that high up has touched a lot of people. There are a lot of people there, holy crap. Take some time, mission. No, I'll be taking over the training from here. What? Sir. You're grounded, Captain, permanently. Boy, this guy really hates him. What are you gonna do? Ice is gone. Yeah, there's nothing to do. He's just over. Those are your pilots. What can he do? I don't know what to do. Find a way. Time to target is now four minutes. You'll be attacking the target from a higher altitude. You'll be sitting ducks for enemy missiles. Yeah, exactly. What is that? Oh, Maverick's doing something he shouldn't be doing probably. Don't see an event scheduled for you, sir. Well, I'm going anyway. <laughs> 215, that's impossible. He's gonna prove to him that it's possible. Oh my gosh, the guy in the front. 
The hangman's gonna be like, this will be entertaining. Oh my gosh. This is gonna make me dizzy. I'm kind of glad I didn't watch this in theaters. Holy crap. I bet people were like, ah, oh. <laughs> All that back and forth and back and forth. He's doing good, right? The noises, I love the sound design for this. Like him breathing hard. Oh, here comes the big climb. Oh, I love that. Okay, we're over. Bombs away. Oh, Jesus. Eight, nine G, 9.5 G. <laughs> nice! Damn. He's that good that he is the best pilot. You have put me in a difficult position, Captain. Yeah, huh? On the one hand, you have demonstrated that this mission can be flown. On the other hand, did it by stealing a multi-million dollar military aircraft and flying it in such a manner that it may never be airworthy. Oh! <laughs> by appointing you team leader. Mmm. I think the Admiral's asking a rhetorical question. Oh, he doesn't want you to tell him. Look at the fancy white outfit. Somebody left their phone on. Is she gonna see him? I would be so scared to get that thing dirty. Anything, I'll get it dirty in like 10 minutes. <laughs> Can you wear white and get away with it? Oh, we're back out on the ocean. Yeah. Dr. Goose. Oh, goodness. Still thinking about Goose. Where you belong. Yeah, he is. Make us proud. This has been great. This has been great so far. That's one hell of a nice elevator you got there. It's been an honor flying with you. This is a very specific mission. Oh, we haven't picked captain or anything yet. Payback and fanboy, Phoenix and Bob. And your wingman. Rooster. Reserve role that's required. So we did pick Rooster to go up. Tomahawk missiles will launch a synchronized strike on the enemy's airfield. Oh, good. Blow up all the fighter jets. That's a good idea. This is what you've all been training for. Come home safe. Oh, do a good job. Do a good job. Do a good job. You give him hell. Well, there's a little bit of vote of confidence there. I just want to say. Yeah, let's get going. Come on. We'll talk. We get back. Yeah, if you get back. You got this. So is is Maverick going too? I don't like that look, man. It's the only one I got. Yeah, it's the only one, the only one he's got. I don't see you again, Hondo. Thank you. Yeah, that's a high stakes, man. It's been an honor, Captain. Good chance I'm not coming back. Dagger three, up and ready. Send them. That's fun! Did Tom get to actually do that? I'm jealous. Dagger one, standby check-in. Woo! All the toys. Oh yeah. Enemy territory up ahead. Yeah, some ship is gonna be like, holy crap! Woo! <laughs> big boy guns! Woo! That would be so cool to see. Dagger set, proceeding to target. Two mark. Okay, two minutes, 30 seconds. Man, some of the shots they got. Oh, <laughs> Yo, lots of Sams. Look at all those missiles, holy crap. Dagger, command chief. Where the hell they come from? Yeah, where did these come from? We have to get there before they do. Increase speed. Two and four are behind schedule. Tomahawk impact in three, two. Oh, there goes the runway. Okay, yeah. Bandits are switching oh, course. They to <laughs> yeah, they changed course really quick, didn't they? Turn and burn. Hands up, Phoenix. Daggers are one minute from target. Come on, Rooster. Yeah, Rooster, move your ass. We really gotta move. Talk to me, Dad. Come on, kid, you can do it. Oh, go. There you go. That's it, kid. That's it. Oh, Rooster, take it easy. All right, now hit your target and come home. Laser is a go. One. Oh, here we go. Up we go. Yeah, 
That makes it kind of tough to see there, Mav. Come on. Get, eyes of that target Get the bomb. laser going. Target Stand by. Bombs away. Okay, we got it. Oh. Up you go. Up you up. Yep, 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 yep. Up, 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 up. Oh, God. Oh, Bob's going bye bye. Boom! Almost there, man. Almost there. Who's sure there's somebody Hit it again. Laser. Oh, gosh. Nine G's. I'm dropping blinds. Who's sure? Oh, we got it. Oh, climb, 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 climb. Oh. <laughs> Big boom, baby. Here it comes. Oh, oh here comes the Sams. Oh, there you go, there you go, there you go. Rooster status. Oh, here comes more. Deploying countermeasures. Oh, jeez. Oh, even more. Jesus, they're everywhere. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. There's so many going. So many rockets. I can't shake them. They're on me. Oh, my gosh. Mav got hit. Yeah, he got hit saving Rooster. We have to circle back. Get him back to the carrier now. What about Maverick? Tell him there's nothing he can do for Maverick. Permission to launch and fly air cover. Negative spare. Oh, he's abandoning him. Dagger, you are not to engage. Acknowledge. Maverick's gone. Oh, man. But they completed their mission. I mean, wasn't that the point? Is he alive? Okay, so we parachuted out. That's a helicopter. Yeah, I heard it. Oh, that's a big helicopter. Oh, Rooster came back. And now Rooster just got hit. He came back to save him. They both gonna freaking get captured. Yeah, I'm good. You all right? Oh. <laughs> I saved your life. I saved your life. That's the whole point. Think. You told me not to think. <laughs> you got yourselves into a pickle, boys. Well, it's good to see you. <laughs> it's good to see you too. Yeah. Now what though? Oh, this is the airport they You're just blew serious. up. What's their plan? You've got to be kidding me. And F-14? We don't even know if that bag of ass can fly. <laughs> uh, let's find out. Uh, so the F-14 is from the first movie, and they're flying F-18s now. Let's start running. Yeah, run, run. Once I give you the signal for air, you're gonna flip this switch until the needle gets to 120. You're gonna pull all the pins and disconnect everything. Like what? It has to minute, like jump start it or something. What's the 120? Is it pressure? Yeah, emergency crank. What pins does he have to pull? Uh, yeah, missiles. Got it. Okay. This thing is so old. <laughs> it's all switches. There's no LED screen or anything to look at. Museum piece in the air. Putting the wings out. Why are the wings coming out, Mav? Is he gonna try and take off right like that? Mav, this yeah. is a taxiway, not a runway. Who's just hanging on? Not today. Pulling some G's up front. You gotta go up, like fast. Oh my gosh, are you gonna go between them? Oh, oh we kind of lost our <laughs> front wheel. We're receiving a signal from Rooster Z set. He's supersonic. He's airborne. Uh-huh. Can't be. It is. Maverick. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But what about the fancy Radio guys? Down. Like, there's a couple of fancy planes that are gonna... Mav, tally two, five o'clock low. Yeah, those things. That That's what I was worried about, those things. Just be cool. If they knew who we were, we'd be dead already. Just wave and smile. He's got no communication. What's, What's he saying? Yeah, no. No communications. His wingman is moving into a weapons envelope. That's not good. These guys. Not their missiles and guns. Then it's a dogfight. An F-14 against fifth gen fighters. It's not the plane, it's the pilot. That's right, yeah. Don't think, just do. Oh, this is a bad idea. <laughs> oh, 
that plane's done for. Smoke in the air, oh, smoke in the air. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Yeah, Mash! Oh, he blew up his buddy. Here comes another one. Oh my gosh. Do we talk, oh. do we talk? What the, what the hell was that? What the f was that? <laughs> Holy cow. Here he comes. Yeah, no, his targeting system's useless, but his guns aren't. He's still on us. They're really low to ground. Brace yourself. Woo oh my gosh. Go get him, man. Got two. There, shoot him shot. now. Damn it. Use your guns. Switching to the guns. There we go, there we go. There we you go. Oh. One last chance. Yeah. Good job. There yeah, you go. I got the radio on. Get us in touch with the boat. Copy that. Oh my god. What is that? Where the hell is this guy? Oh crap. Damn it. We're no. in the Smoke in the air. Whoa. We're out of flares, man. He's coming around so fast. Oh. We took another hit. Oh god. We got to eject. What is we need yeah. altitude. Whoa! There we go. Up we go. Eject! Rooster, pull the handle! Oh, no. Eject! It's not working! He's gonna kill him. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. No! Oh! <laughs> Who did it? Who was it? Good afternoon. It's Hangman! Your savior speak. <laughs> you look good. I am good, Rooster. Uh -huh. um, he has no front tie. He has got no front wheel, though. No front landing gear, no tail hook. Oh, God, it's fly by the tower. Please don't tell me we lost an engine. All right, I won't tell you. Yeah, you got two of them. It's okay. Oh, God. Woo! Kind of scuffed the paint a little bit, but we're okay. <laughs> you good? Yeah. Yeah! Way to go! So good! Love it! There you go. Now you gotta say, you be my wingman. Just have another kill. That makes two. Yeah? Mav has five. Yo! He's got five. But Rooster killed the uh, helicopter thing, right? Sir. Yay! Hugs for everybody! Thank you for saving my life. That's what my dad would've done. He's right. Everybody got home safe. Oh, we gotta go back to the bar and let her know that he's safe. Penny around? She took Amelia on a sailing trip. Oh, she went sailing. Oh, Rooster's working on the plane with him. He must be back where he, we started this. Oh, look who's there. Yeah, her and her little Porsche. Yay. Oh, we're gonna go for a little ride. Why? How fun would that be? This life with yeah, there's his daddy. <laughs> Yay, Val Kilmer. Ed, yeah. John Hamm. We're meeting everybody. Miles Teller. Whee! <laughs> Yay. Let's talk about it. That was Top Gun Maverick, and how fantastic was that? I mean, the first one, Top Gun, was really, really good. And this, I think, was just as good. It really, I mean, it kept you really involved in the story. Everybody was so fantastic. And uh, you get to this big climax and all the fighter jets, <laughs> missiles, <laughs> I mean, come on. What's not to love? <laughs> you get a love story in there. Yeah. This was great. I really did enjoy it. I It was so fun. Uh, I think I'm happy that I didn't see it in the theaters because there was a couple of scenes where I was like, like, <laughs> my brain was like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> And I know, like, this was like an IMAX, wasn't it? Where you get like the massive like wraparound screen. Yeah, 
My brain probably wouldn't have liked that too much. It's like, yeah, I don't really get like seasick or anything like that, but crazy fast like movement would make me a little dizzy. I don't, I think that all looks like so much fun. I am super jealous of Tom and all the fun things he got to do for this movie. Like taking off from an aircraft carrier in an F-18. Would you do that? I would totally do that. <laughs> it looked like at the end, he was actually like flying that uh, propeller plane at the end and doing some loop-de-loops and stuff. That all looks like so much fun to me. It really does. <laughs> I think I'd really like that. I just knew um, Tom and Val Kilmer and Ed Harris were the only three that I knew from this. And Ed, I know from a couple of movies. What was Ed in? I know Ed from a couple. From Truman Show, I know him from that. And then I think he was in... Oh, 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 The Abyss. Was Ed Harris in The Abyss, I think? And something else. I'm not sure uh, what I've seen with Ed Harris 100%. And I've seen Tom in A Few Good Men and in um, Top Gun, of course. But I don't remember if I've seen him in anything else. I don't know. I'll have to check my channel. And I'll put links for each of the different actors' reactions that I've done. Val Kilmer, I'm pretty sure I've only seen him in the first Top Gun. I don't think I've seen anything else for him. Yeah. I have so much catching up to do. <laughs> if you want to like comment like what I should like, if I want to catch up on Val and Tom and Ed, like, and I, it's not one of the links that I provided for movies I've seen them in, you know, put them down below and I'll make sure they're on my list. But I really, I like some of these, like Tom Cruise is a big actor, right? Like, my favorite actor, like, right now is Tom Hanks, Robin Williams. Um, and I've seen a whole bunch of Tom Hanks movies. And I've seen, like, three or four Robin Williams movies. The last one, Robin Williams, I think I saw was um, Good Will Hunting. It was so good. Oh, when I cried at the end, it was so good. But um, I have a lot of catching up to do. And I'm slowly, you know catching up but i still have a long way to go <laughs> anyways let me know what i should be watching below and if you want to be one of the one that help pick which movies i watch check out my patreon um and there's so much content on both youtube and patreon all my full reactions to all these movies are on patreon and then the youtube versions the like cut down half hour versions are on youtube but uh yeah Huh. Well, I'm just so happy I watched this. I really am. And, um, yeah. Thank you for watching. Thanks for checking it out. Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see some more. And, as always, never forget that you are awesome. Thanks for watching. Bye.